James Webb Space Telescope, 13 galaxy cluster images. The miracles are not yet out of this world, or maybe they are. So many extraordinary and bizarre things are happening outside our beloved Earth. Until recently, we could not see it with our own eyes. Fortunately, we humans are special creatures. Thanks to NASA, ESA, and other space agencies, we have been able to lay our eyes on beautiful images from outer space. You don't want to miss any news about the James Webb Space Telescope, NASA, and other space updates, right? So make sure you give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Now let's dive in. Number 1. The Mass of Two Quadrillion Suns This image shows something spectacular, a massive galaxy cluster that is warping the space around it. The cluster, whose heart is at the centre of this frame, is named RCS2-J2327. This cluster is one of the most massive clusters known. Massive objects such as RCS2-J2327 have such a strong influence on their surroundings that they visibly warp the space around them. This effect is also known as gravitational lensing. When this happens, the light from more distant objects can be bent, distorted, and magnified, allowing us to see galaxies that would otherwise be far too distant to detect so easy. Gravitational lensing is one of the predictions of Einstein's theory of general relativity. Number 2. Galaxy Cluster Abel 3827 This image shows the rich galaxy cluster Abel 3827. The strange blue structures surrounding the central galaxies are gravitationally lensed views of a much more distant galaxy behind the cluster. Observations of the central four merging galaxies have provided hints that the dark matter around one of the galaxies is not moving with the galaxy itself, possibly implying dark matter interactions of an unknown nature are occurring. Number 3. View Towards the Great Attractor in this image, you see the Great Attractor. This region is at an angular distance of about 7 degrees from the main plane of the Milky Way. The foreground stars in the Milky Way mostly appear as whitish spots. Many background galaxies are also seen. They form a huge cluster, named ACO3627. With a number of bright galaxies near the center, they stand out by their larger size and yellowish color. Isn't this incredible? Number 4. Pandora's Cluster This image shows a wide view of merging galaxy cluster Abel 2744 because so many different and strange phenomena have been unleashed by a huge collision that occurred over a period of 350 million years. A simultaneous pileup between at least four separate clusters produced strange effects that have never been seen together before. This image will be used to study the distribution of dark matter in this complex cluster. Number 5. Alma's Hole in the Universe the events surrounding the Big Bang were so cataclysmic that they left an indelible imprint on the fabric of the cosmos. We can detect these scars today by observing the oldest light in the universe. As it was created nearly 14 billion years ago, this light exists now as weak microwave radiation, also known as CMB. CMB has now expanded to permeate the entire cosmos, filling it with detectable photons. We can detect the CMB here on Earth when its constituent microwave photons travel to us through space. On their journey to us, they can pass through galaxy clusters that contain high-energy electrons. These electrons give the photons a tiny boost of energy. They can help astronomers to understand some of the fundamental properties of the universe, such as the location and the distribution of dense galaxy clusters. Number 6. The Hyperion Proto Supercluster The observatory has uncovered a colossal structure in the early universe. This galaxy proto supercluster, which they nicknamed Hyperion, was unveiled by new measurements and a complex examination of archive data. This is the largest and most massive structure yet found at such a remote time and distance, nearly 2 billion years after the Big Bang. How crazy is that? Number 7. Distant Cluster MS1008.1-1224 The distant cluster of galaxies MS1008.1-1224 is at some 3 billion light years away from us. The galaxies you see in this image of the cluster are shown as they were 3 billion years ago. They are different from galaxies in our neighborhood, their stellar populations, on average, are much younger. Number 8. The Cluster of Galaxies Abel 315 This image reveals thousands of galaxies crowding an area on the sky roughly as large as the full moon. These galaxies span a vast range of distances from us. Some are relatively close, as it is possible to distinguish their spiral arms or elliptical halos, especially in the upper part of the image. The more distant, instead, appear just like faint blobs. Their light has travelled through the universe for 8 billion years or more before reaching Earth. A concentration of about 100 yellowish galaxies identifies a massive galaxy cluster named Abel 315, about 2 billion light years away from us. Number 9. A Distant Cluster of Galaxies This image shows a distant cluster. Some of the brightest objects are galaxies with brilliant centres, powered by supermassive black holes. The cluster at the centre of the picture shows up as an extended patch of light emission coming from hot gases. Number 10. The Fornax Galaxy Cluster 
The Fornax galaxy cluster is one of the closest such groupings beyond our own local group of galaxies. The Fornax galaxy cluster can be divided into two subclusters. The main one, centered on NGC 1399, and a subgroup, centered on NGC 1316. NGC 1316 is in the process of infilling with the largest subcluster to finally merge with it, and whose galaxies are experiencing strong star formation activity. As with many other galaxy clusters, the Fornax cluster is filled with a hot, rarefied gas and contains a number of intergalactic stars, some of which have produced novae. Number 11, Messier 87 in the Virgo cluster. This image of the Virgo cluster is showing the diffuse light between the galaxies belonging to the cluster. The dark spots indicate where bright foreground stars were removed from the image. Messier 87 is the largest galaxy in this picture. The Virgo cluster contains some 2,000 galaxies. Discovered in 1781 by Charles Messier, this galaxy is located 54 million light years away from Earth in the constellation Virgo. Number 12. Dark matter and galaxies in the cluster Abel 2744. This image exposes galaxy cluster Abel 2744. The galaxies in this cluster, while they are the only part that is visible in the optical part of the spectrum, actually only provide around 5% of the mass in this cluster. Hot intracluster gas, shown in pink and responsible for around 20% of the mass in this cluster, is visible through its light emission. The blue overlay shows a map of the mass in the cluster. This is reconstructed based on the detailed analysis of the way that the cluster bends light from galaxies in the distant background. Evidence of this light bending can be seen in arc-like distortions in parts of this image. Since dark matter makes up the lion's share of mass in the cluster, about 75%, this blue overlay reveals the location of the otherwise invisible dark matter. Number 13. Galaxy Cluster RCS2-032727-132623 In this image, you see this close-up look at the brightest distant galaxy in the universe known to date. It is one of the most striking examples of gravitational lensing, where the gravitational field of a foreground galaxy bends and amplifies the light of a more distant background galaxy. In this image, the light from a distant galaxy, nearly 10 billion light years away, has been warped into a nearly 90 degree arc of light in the galaxy cluster RCS2-032727-132623. The galaxy cluster lies about 5 billion light years away from Earth. Isn't that fascinating? Thank you for watching the video. Which picture fascinated you the most? Let us know in the comments. If you loved watching this video, press the link and subscribe to stay notified of the latest updates about the James Webb Space Telescope, NASA News, and other space updates. Have a great day, and I will see you soon in our next video.